to the Wake Up With Jim's Zeb podcast. Welcome to the Welcome to the Daily Back. Daily Back is back. Welcome to the Wake Up With Jim and Zeb podcast. Welcome to the Wake Up With Jim and Zeb podcast. This is day three of our Daily Back. Welcome to the. <laughs> this is our peace offering for ghosting you all those weeks. Yeah, I think one week and a month, maybe like ten days. Yeah. Did you guys miss us? Cause yeah. If, no. huh? think so much. <laughs> hey, so okay. Parang I remember Jim was talking to me about today's topic, and he said, "Let's do our own research, and then we'll just meet during recording, and then discuss what we've researched." I think I will let you take the lead on this one, Jim, because I've been. Busy <laughs> fighting out cowboys. I've been killing um cowboys. No. So when you're yeah. not breastfeeding, you are robbing banks, killing cowboys. Just killing the bad guys. Okay. And Sab is talking about Red Dead Redemption 2. It's anyway. Video game on PlayStation 4. For so, welcome to the podcast where we always say welcome to, we say anyway. Anyway. This is um, basically a year-ender podcast. Uh, we are going to... Sp- we are... We <laughs> are the one. We are going <laughs> to... So, we're going to... Once. <laughs> We're gonna split this into two episodes. Okay. Uh, so part one is a very um, we wanted to make a best of 2018. Mm-hmm. So we're gonna do best of 2018 TV shows, best of 2018 movies, and best of 2018 songs. Okay. Okay. Just for us. For us. Personal preference. The opinions expressed in this podcast are do reflect Jim and Sabs and Jim and Sabs only. So anyway, uh, I think 2018 in terms of movies, movies. Let's start with movies first. I think okay, man. Again, uh, <laughs> <laughs> all ha- right, that's it. <laughs> hashtag analysis. Well, 2018 for movies was ano ba? Talagang I think we really felt this year the the power of streaming. Grabe yung sentence construction. Yun. Sobrang atene yung atene yung. What? Talagang we felt the... Did I say Parang... It? Yes, you said it. <laughs> hey. Uh, <laughs> we'll edit this. Hashtag we'll, no to bullying. We're gonna edit. 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 Et- <laughs> <laughs> we're gonna edit this. <laughs> it's currently five in the morning as we oh record my. this. We wanna <laughs> stay true to... Wake up with Jim and Sab. Authentic. Okay, game. Can, so, can we do a rundown on the notable movies that came yeah, out? Yeah, that's why. That's, that's no, no, not the best for us, but the best for, I mean, just the movies that came out. Yes, that's what I'm going to do. Is it okay that I just introduced it for our listeners or is that not allowed? Because I thought this was a Jim and Sab show. Is it just the Jim show? Because if it is, I'm out. <laughs> <laughs> Well, I was doing the intro. Eh. Okay. Ano eh, ang tagal, ang tagal, ang tagal. Let's do it. Let's move on. Jim, wala nang akong contribution dito, diba? Yun na lang. Ine, ito Kasi na. nga, wala nang akong ni-research. It, pero ito na nga, sinasabi ko lang na 2018 was really the, the, parang we really felt the impact of streaming. Na most of the movies and the things that we remember in terms of um, content, um, we remember either we streamed it on Netflix or whatever. I think we watched less than five movies in the cinema. Diroman. Possible. Less than this ten. This year? Less than ten. For sure. Less than ten. Oh, five. I'm Impo- going to try to... Impossible five. As we go down the list, lalagpas tayo ng, tw- ng five. Oh, anyway. Okay. So this is um, the movies that came out 2018. So we'll just say if we didn't watch it or not. And then in the end, we will say what our top three is. Are we going to say yay, nay? Never watched it. Yeah. Yay. Uh, super yay. Yay. Wally. Nay. <laughs> super nay. And Wally is didn't watch, didn't watch it. it. The Mule. This is Clint Eastwood. I know it's about, you know, drug trafficking, moving drugs around. He's basically the mule. 
Wale. Wale. We didn't, didn't watch, it. watch it. I am not a witch. Wale. Wale. What's that? Who is that? I don't know. Can you read it for? Uh, okay. In Zambia, women are still accused of being witches. Oh, that sounds interesting. That's not, wait, I, I just want to know who's in it. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Maggie Muluba. Okay, pass. Next. <laughs> hey, it sounds interesting, huh? Okay, is it scary? Hey, look. In Zambia, women are still accused of being witches and then sent to live in camps, forced to perform manual labor, compelled to preside over criminal trials where they're supposed to use their supernatural powers to make judgments. This insane real life scenario is brought to bleak, bleakly st- satiric life. By that that sounds like Handmaid's Tale vibes, no? Game. Mm-hmm. Let's watch we'll that. We'll get there. Sorry. <sighs> <laughs> I, I will not speak na. Kidding. Just kidding. The favorite. This is, uh, I think we saw a trailer for this. It's Rachel Weisz, Emma Stone. It's yung parang 18th century, parang you, when we... Ah yes, I, I, the favorite. That's a no. Um, medieval times, uh, not medieval times. Okay, okay. We thought na it was gonna be parang what you were like when we saw the trailer. Parang sabi mo. I oh, wanted to watch that. Parang Marie Antoinette. Yeah. Cool. Uh, Is wale, it? Wale. We didn't yeah, we didn't watch it. it, but I want to see it. Mission yeah. Impossible. Of course, we watched the Fall Out. <laughs> of course, we watched the super box office hit. That was an amazing movie. Super yay. Super yay. Super duper yay. Super yay. I love Tom Cruise. I, I know I know he's problematic. Di but I. I uh, he is. He's still a Scientologist. And whatever. Why? Anyway. I'm I'm Scientologist. I mean, why is that? Parang, aren't you being a um, something religion? Prejudice? Yeah. Well, I just think with the days, I actually, you know what? Parang it's just, you know what? I don't know what to say. Anyway, mission because impossible. what I would say about Scientology, you can easily say about other religions, I guess. Yeah, so that's but enough. I just don't like now nah, they get a lot of money, yeah. which is super. What other religions do? Not that much, just. Oh, okay. <laughs> oh anyway. Uh, why was it super yay? Quickly. In, Sobrang in 30, in 30, Okay, in bathroom 15, scene. In, that's it. In, okay. Bathroom scene. <sighs> okay, in it's supposed to be in 15 seconds. Why super yay? Okay, bathroom scene. Ako, non-stop action. Great, I mean, simple plot, but um, great directing. And it brings you back to the time of great action movies. Okay. Sure. Yeah, but I want to see the f- pictures. Okay, okay. We're not allowed to use phones in this podcast, so yeah, we're not using a phone. Yeah, nga, that's I why I wrote down the list. I want to be part of this. I know. Computer seventeen. Bisby seventeen. What's it about? Uh, it's about Mexican miners, German and Mexican miners who are on strike. Interesting. Grabe, para ang daming maganda. Oh, hey, that's wait, wait, my wait, wait, okay. Wait, wait. Sobrang ganda movies this year. All right. We haven't seen any of these. Uh, Burning. It stars... What's his name again? Um, Steven, Steven Yeun. Yun. The guy from... Glenn from Glenn The Walking, from Walking Dead. Dead. Love him. So what is it about? It's... So this is a list basically of movies we haven't seen. Uh, what's the... Okay. Next. Leave no... Tr- Puta na naman. Oh, sorry. <laughs> Puta na naman bash. <laughs> We have not heard of no, these oh movies. My. Leave No Trace. Ano ba ito? Indie Film Fest? Parang ganun nga eh. Um, Palagay ka nalang box office hits. Just. Okay. Anyway, I think, yeah, hindi nga. I think, watched um, this is Lady Bird. Movie. So, ayun, okay. Was that 2018? 2018? That's not. Yes. So, ito na. Di ba? I will Shit. now, I'll, 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 okay. Another list. Sorry. Again, sorry guys. <sighs> Avengers Infinity War Super Thanos Yay, yay. <laughs> Gauntlet Yay Infinity Yay <laughs> Ganda Ang ganda Yun ang maganda Grabe Sobrang Infinity Yay Infinity, Infinity yay. War Ang ganda ng Infinity Yay I Gusto ko manood ba? ulit We just rewatched just it, it. Yeah. Ang ganda And we were actually last night 
kagabi nga magkasama kami ni Kyle and Enzo. Our and, and we were talking about each scene. We could... Ay, sayang wala ako. Oh, it's okay. Anyway. Okay. Um, Engage all defenses. And somebody get this man a shield. <laughs> Waganda forever! <laughs> okay. I love Black Panther. Black Panther. Did it come out 2018? Oh, yes, yeah, it did. Yeah, it did. Yeah. Yay. Yay. I think we need to rewatch it though. Yeah. Yay. Yay. I, I liked it. I liked it. I just want to watch it again. I just compare, I mean, if we're going to say, if we're going to come from Infinity War, super yay. Black Panther is yay. Because, you know why? I think, you know what ruined it for me? Not ruined. Parang, again, everyone because it's like, oh my God, dude, you haven't seen Black Panther. Fuck. It's really good though. But it, it, really it deserved good. that. But it thing, deserved that. The thing is, because like, people on the ringer, um, your, po- your favorite podcast. Yeah, they all of them are like, all the articles were like, um, anion, parang Black Panther for an Oscar. Ganun, ganun. And this parang is the thing. Naman siya Oscar word. This is an unpopular. Just. This is an unpopular opinion. Okay. Sure, Michael B. Jordan. Ah, uh, that. But I agree. Is a tad bit overrated. I agree. He's the same. He plays the same character, or he acts the same way. Uh, uh, he played the same guy in Fruitvale, in um, the Chronicle, the Chronicles, mm. the Chronicle, 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 um, Creed, mm. and as Killmonger. Yeah, parang same. So brang bangas, bangas ng name na Killmonger. And you know, I mean, I just love it. Sorry, he's very hot. <laughs> in contribution ko. Pero again, He's a very hot guy but I agree. Very I hot guy. Very his hot guy. facial expressions are the same. The same. His um hmm, what do you want? What do you want, huh? I'm like bah, you can you can do it. like what do you want Black Panther and it can be also what do you want Drago? <laughs> it's the same thing. Yeah. I'm Adonis. I'm Black Panther. I, he's not Black Panther. He's not. Panther. He's longer. <laughs> <laughs> but Black Panther, what's the name of the actor? Love him. Chad. It's like, it's Chad Michael Murray. Just kidding. <laughs> Chad Bo- something. Bozeman. No, Bozeman. Bozeman. Chadwick Bozeman. Bozwick. Chad, Chad Man Bozwick. <laughs> <laughs> Gagu Chadwick Bozeman. Yeah. Right? I just, whatever. <laughs> it sounds like Bojack Horseman. <laughs> Next movie. Oh my gosh. It's Next movie. Like Bojack Horseman. A Star is Born. Super Star. yay. Star yay. S- Super Star yay. <laughs> Super Star. Oh! <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Beautiful songs. I'm still... Uh, <laughs> I was about to sing. But um, I'm still... Uh, the thing is with A Star Is Born, you know, I liked it. You know, you knew naman. I kind of knew what to expect. It's just I think when I didn't know what to expect because I didn't read anything about it. No, beforehand. but I mean, like what you've seen, Begin Again, mm-hmm. you've seen uh, once. Mm-hmm. Kumbaga, you know what flow you can expect, and despite that, um, it's just Bradley Cooper and Lady Gaga were just so good. Ang ganda ng chemistry nila. And the Songs music, the music was phenomenal. When the sound comes down mm-hmm. and the band won't play, I'll always remember us this way. Thank you. Um, next. Lady Gaga Oscar, please. I don't care about Bradley the Bradley Cooper. Mas importante pa ang Jim and Sab Awards. Yay. <laughs> a quiet place. Uh, uh, super yay. Krasinski yay. <laughs> Emily yay. <laughs> <laughs> Grabe. Grabe. And I heard that Bird Box is similar, which is a Netflix movie. And people have been asking. We have two Netflix movies. Um... To watch. To watch for Netflix nitpicks. Yeah. Bird Box and Bandersnatch, Young Black Mirror. Yeah. I think it's a mini movie. So if you listen to this podcast, we listen have- to those shows, and we're going to do a Netflix nit. 
Net, oh. Netflix, Netflix, Netflix. <laughs> Stop it. We'll do individual ones para hindi tayo mag-spoil ng kahit ano. And even with this list, we're not gonna spoil we're not anything. We're spoiling anything. Okay? Quiet Place, grabe, the ending. <laughs> <laughs> Remember that ending? Uh, basta. Uh, what I loved about A Quiet Place, again, in, in 15 seconds, was it's a, it's such there is a progress, a, a tremendous progression of characters, and parang it's a normal family story and dynamic, but it's wrapped in this fucking weird horror plot. And alam mo, I know, I I don't know for a fact, but I am thinking it would be hard to act with your real life partner, but they were so good together, huh? Emily Blunt and John Krasinski. If if tayo, if kunwari, sinabi nila, Sab, Jim, gawa kayo ng movie. Ako kaya ko, ikaw hindi mo kaya. Kaya ko yun. <laughs> kaya ko yun. Kunwari, sabihin nila. Actually, ako hindi ko kaya. Kunwari, sabihin nila na, oh, Jim, Sab, bigyan ka namin ng ilang million. Oh. Gawa okay, kayo Okay, guys. Ng... Um, let's go to gogetfunding.com. Let's fund this movie. Just Kickstarter. Yeah. Kaya, kaya ko yun. <laughs> You've never acted. Oh, so? <laughs> <laughs> Oh nga naman, kasi kung love mo talaga ako. Oh naman. Okay. Next. Ito, ito. Annihilation. This is Natalie Portman. It was released Natalie on... K lang. <laughs> <laughs> it was on Netflix. Uh, basically, it's like a... It's of, like a... A group of scientists looking for something. <laughs> it's what I would imagine visually what it would look like if you take acid or something. It's visually stunning. Yes, and both of us have never taken acid, so it's the closest thing. Well, I would assume <laughs> so that we, we would assume not in it. Um, Natalie Portman was great, but Natalie Portman is I don't know. gorgeous. Maybe it because maybe because we couldn't hear any. Apparently, the audio wasn't good. Small shout out to um, what's her name? Oh, tama ba to? Oh no, I think I'm wrong. Anyway. Yeah, Next. Small shout out to, I think the girl from Orphan Black is in there and I love her. So, yeah. Ah, yeah, yeah, yeah. Next. First Man. Direct- Super Snore. <laughs> <laughs> hey. First Z. No. Just kidding. So, this was Sleep Man. <laughs> <laughs> Come on. I'm kidding. You know what? Ryan Gosling is a sweetheart. So, First hey, Man is me. about. Um, <laughs> Neil Armstrong. Uh, it's um, it's a it's a kind of a deeper take on his personal. It's a it's a sorry. It's a different view on more on his family life and whatever. It's directed by Damien Chazelle. Chazelle something. Who did La La Land? Oh. Whiplash. I think I'm gonna watch it because I didn't finish it. Eh. We didn't. It was finish a bad it and we were sleepy. It's a bad time to watch. So, it. but it see. it seemed very promising. Loved. Um. <sighs> The girl from The Crown is in it, and I love her. So, Incredibles 2. Incredible knee. <laughs> Super knee. Sobrang pangit. Incredible knee. I fucking loved The Incredibles. You know what gets incredible, yay? What? The short film before it, Bao. Yeah. Just True. Angel. True. Incredibles 2. It took what? 10, 12 10 years? years? Before the sequel, didn't my pinaka issue is why wait that long for to to make something like that? It could have touched on so many things that's new that's happened now in you know, you know. Parang, Sobrang babaw. Ang babaw and oh my gosh, screens. Ugh. Corny. Ne, I I know I know that's what they were trying to do. No, parang, yeah, but parang as if it's never been you know. Yeah, but, Ganda kaya nung first one. So yeah, parang binasos na yung first one. I think what why why we're so annoyed is because ang gaganda ng characters. Diba? Yeah. In in the first one, the characters so good and their arc, the character arc was so fluid and you could, you know, you could connect. Ito wala. Okay, next. Into the Spider-Verse. Into the Spider-Yay. Wali. <laughs> 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 No, it's super na- super yay. Super yay. I incredible yay. Amazing yay. Amazing yay. The amazing yay. Your friendly neighborhood yay. yay. <laughs> uh, can't say 
You know, it's out on, I think it? now that it's MMFF, it's the only movie on IMAX. On IMAX. And I think we should watch it because I hear it's really good ng 3D. This may be the best Spider-Man movie ever. <clears throat> I think it is. It is. It is. It is. It is. Sorry, Toby. Oh, Sorry, Tobes. So, Just... if I were to rank it, Spider-Verse, Spider-Man 2, mm-hmm. Toby Maguire. With Mary Jane getting married. And not Mary Jane. Yeah, she was in a wedding dress. She almost, almost got, got married, married. And then you go him. get him, Tiger. Yes. Oh. Then stopping the train. <laughs> oh. Spider-Man. Uh, and then the third is the Tom Holland. Just erase mo lang lahat ng Andrew Garfield. Yes. Next. Bird Box. We have not watched. Solo. So. No. No. <laughs> K lang. So K lang. Wala. Um, I have nothing to say. Well, the thing is, the mind. It's okay. I yeah. mean, yeah, it's a movie. My thing is, because it's like, Star Wars, man, like, Han Solo, he doesn't, des- he, I don't know, it didn't, he didn't need, it, this wasn't the time for him to have a solo movie. So No pun movie. intended. <laughs> okay. Uh, anyway, it was just, it just felt What do you like, mean by it's not the time? I don't know. Parang you're, we're so hooked on what's happening with the the new trilogy. Parang it, it, I agree. There's it, so much happening, and you know Han just died, and we just saw Harrison Ford spoiler reprise joke. that role after how many years? Yeah. And then you need you you're gonna stuff us with stuff our yeah. You're gonna <laughs> stuff us. <laughs> with what are you a, trying to say, Han? You're gonna force. It down, Feed, shove it down our throats. That's what you're trying to say. You're gonna stuff, stuff and it. shove it. <laughs> um, a new solo. Well, voila. Doesn't make sense. Ant-Man and the Wasp. Ant-Man and in the... the no. In the no. <laughs> Baby, you're losing it. Nayman and the Wasp. Sobrang ne. Yeah. I love Paul Rudd. He is my ultimate love. He is Jim's Hollywood version. Mm-hmm. Yes. I, I'm sorry. I did not mean to be <laughs> your Nike egg. Sorry. <laughs> That's I'm, exactly what a Paul Rudd <laughs> character would do, Jen. Sorry, sorry. So, <clears throat> it broke my heart na sobrang corny na tong second movie. <laughs> Grabe. Sobrang corny. And sayang eh. Kasi Evangeline Lily, I love her. And, you know. Did Deadpool 2 come out this year? Yes. I yeah. like that. Deadpool 2 was super yay. yay. Ako yay lang, not on super. Ako super yay. I liked it more than the first one. The first one was okay. Next one, Ready Player One. 2018? Yeah. Super yay. Actually, I take it back. What? Ready Player Book na lang. Compared to the book, it... it I'm telling you, it did not do it justice. But it, the movie was really fun. The movie was fun. I mean, pero it. Didn't okay, so you know, you watched, the, you you read the book. I got it. <laughs> uh, okay, now last two. Last two. No, no, no. Yeah, because we're gonna give, we're gonna choose our Bohemian. Ita na, ita na. Oh no. Bohemian. Oh no, we're gonna get into a lot of trouble. Mama just killed a movie. <laughs> Bohemian Rhapsody. <laughs> okay. Wait, wait. Do you have the I think we should have our own. We will. We will. We will. We will. Fail you. Book, 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 book. Okay. Why? Should we? I I I feel like we can talk about this in detail. Yeah, I, I mean, we were supposed to do a review on this, but um, go ahead. Should we? Yeah. Why we didn't like it? Yes. Well, the whole for me, it's just one one of the greatest bands ever, and parang I feel like the movie did not do them justice. And one of the greatest personalities. Yes, ever. Freddie Mercury. In that time, he is parang. It's like making a. I feel like, but if you made a Bowie movie, na ganito, that oh would be God. so disrespectful. Yeah. Parang he everyone was so, was so excited about the Freddie Mercury biopic, and then 
it just super disappointed. Because it became like what I said to Jim. It was like glee. Exactly. And but I don't want to see Freddie Mercury in glee. <laughs> no, diba? I mean, yeah, he's yeah. a deeper guy. If you watch his interviews, he's so charming and witty and he's kind of an asshole. And especially because, I mean, not, not a spoiler because it's a, it's based on real life anyway. He did die of AIDS and parang, the movie could have talked more about AIDS and parang in, in this oh, no, day man. and age, it, you know, the, a movie has to have a bigger impact, parang social impact. Yung sexuality niya, parang, hindi masyadong... Yeah, he just... Parang, okay, oh. The, yeah. It's a one. Okay. So, I don't, I, social I, message. Okay, yun ito. Call I, to action. Okay. I agree with you, everything you're saying, except for the fact na sana they focus on AIDS because, of course, they want to focus on their life. I, they wanted to focus on his life and his accomplishments and whatever. Pero I really like what you, when you said na parang, parang the story is a guy who is who was bullied, diba? Who had to stay in the closet, who had so many complexities, but was so, parang on you know growing up he was so quiet, diba? He had the buck teeth and everything, mm-hmm. and then he became this. Um, superstar that yeah. you know com- that could come out that could command like thousands of people, and eh, um and yun nga, parang it parang for me it was just way too simplified as a parang hey I'm a kid I have buck teeth hi guys can you be in my band hey let's become famous oh I'm gonna die now yun parang um parang it just oversimplified. A story that could have been so much, you know, much more complex. And, you know, you could have us, like, as as fans, parang, I would have wanted to have a deeper understanding of, like, wh- where these songs came from. Parang, like, Bohemian Rhapsody. Love that song. Alam mo, parang, I wanted to know, like, parang, I just hate the fact na, they're in a, like, yung, the way they pitched it to Mike Myers. Like, I want opera. I want ganyan. Just, opera? Like, and then biglang, in the barn. Parang, I want to know, why, what led you to, to, to do that? What, le, parang, and then, guwari, yung guitar solo, like, parang, ah, uh, parang sobrang sayang. We will rock you. That was, out of nowhere. that was the worst scene talaga yung, why don't we do this? Parang, oh my God. So sorry. I think the, sorry to all the people who love it. I think the, um, what do you call it? The production house they were conflicted kung ano yung mamark, anong market yung tinatarget nila. The if glee, it, yung Glee market. Why, yeah. why? Why would the Glee market be interested in be- watching Freddie Mercury's backstory? They probably don't yeah. even know who he is. Because the Glee market naman, they didn't know, they didn't like naman, um, the so- like what, yung songs naman ng Glee, hindi naman siya puro Rihanna and stuff eh. Diba? Like, Ryan Murphy used a lot of songs that weren't like the most popular for the ch- for the market. The point is, like, you put out this movie and then they hear, they everyone knows Bohemian. Everyone knows We Will Rock You. So they hear it, oh, this is fun. So anyway. But hey, in, in, in all fairness, if there was if there was anything that the movie achieved, it's that younger people now know more Queen songs and they love Queen as well. And hey, they achieved that. Okay. Pero the, the, the thing... Para, I just think hindi nila ginawa ng justice si Freddie Mercury. Especially, I know you say na the movie's not supposed to be like an AIDS awareness thing, but he did die and he made it his mission to raise funds for AIDS and awareness. So, mm-hmm. parang yun lang. Parang, should have... Okay. Pero... <laughs> what? Ayan. Um, ito. The band kasi wanted it to be a wholesome movie. It was the band who, um, parang they didn't want to share too much of his, you know, promiscuity and all that shit. Pero, okay, and actually, I, I got that. Diba, nagka, nagkaroon nga kami ng exchange ni Ellie. Like, mm-hmm. I texted him, like, happy birthday, man. And, P.S., sobrang pangit ng Bohemian. And then, nagalit rin siya. <laughs> I mean, he said, like, I absolutely loved it. Just brought me back to the, you know, the 
80s. So parang, again, I mean, most people we know loved it. So, unpopular opinion. We are sorry. Maybe we suck. No, we don't. <laughs> so now we've said most of the, so, ano, parang the top, the, the funnest movies of 2018. Most fun. <laughs> most <laughs> fun movies of 2018. And now we are going to des- decide what our top three is. Yun na ba yun? Parang kulang. Yeah, yun na yun. Can I? Okay, ikaw. What are your top? Um, go. Infinity A. See, tama. Ito nga. We haven't seen Roma. Yeah. It's on Netflix. Uh, people are saying it's the best movie of the year. It's Alfonso Cuaron. But what we're talking about naman today is I've changed the category. <laughs> it's the 2018 most fun Oh, movies. most fun. I mean, a drama can be fun. <laughs> Best na lang. <laughs> okay. For us. Okay, so what? Ano na lang, di alam ka na. Top? Top three. Super yay. Yun na lang. Oh yeah, top three, super yay. Okay. So, to recap, what are... What were... The ones. <laughs> what were the ones that were super yayed? So we have Avengers, Infinity Yay, A Star is Yay, A Quiet Yay, yay. <laughs> Mission Impossible. Oh, you did not even mention Crazy Rich Asians. That's a big deal. Because you didn't watch it. Yeah. I watched it. It was Yay. Mission Impossible, Fall Yay, <laughs> Spider Vase. Yay out. I don't know who Mission Impossible, yay out. <laughs> um, we didn't watch Break the Internet. Oh, Breaks the Internet. We didn't watch Venom. That bilb. We to did, all the boys I loved before. We did not watch uh, Creed, Creed 2. two. Oh. Anyway. We did not watch Venom. I think it sucked. So, ano ang top three mo sabi? Infinity, yay. Number three. Infinity Yay Let. <laughs> Joke. Uh, Infinity War. Um, mm-hmm. uh, oh. Sige, ako, comic book movie. Why? Infinity War. Ah, okay, okay. Sige, I, I, think I, I think I have my three. It's a well-balanced three. Is I'm it? very happy with my three. <laughs> you want to go first? Wait, ako muna. Ay, sorry. Um... If I write school, right? Ah, okay. So, Into the Spider-Verse. Okay. Infinity War. Okay. And, I guess A Star is Born. Number one mo. Ah, in ano ba to? Yeah. In ano? Yes. I didn't know. Number one ko would be... <sighs> you know what? Yeah, A Star is Born is my number one. Fuck it. You're going for it. Yeah, because it's the one that really affected me emotionally. Okay. Is this a lock? Are you I'm locking, locking it down. You're locking it? I'm locking it. Okay. Wait, 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 wait. I'm locking it. Handshake. Can you hear the handshake? Weird okay, handshake. that's a lock. Mine is number three. A quiet place. I know, sorry. <laughs> Number three is Spider Verse. Number three? Yeah. Number two is A Quiet Place. And number one is, I'm sorry, Infinity War. So that is our 2018 best movies. A well researched. 2018. We have to lock in the name of this award show. Uh. This This has been the 2018. Yay. 2018 Super Super Yays. yays. Yeah. Movies. Super Yays. No, just it's called Super Yays Movies Edition. Okay. <laughs> All right. We'll see you tomorrow for... How long have we been recording? Can you check? 30 minutes. 
then I guess we'll see you tomorrow for the TV show edition. This is the part, yeah, the part two. So anyway, when you get back from your vacation, um, yun, we have uh, a lot of episodes lined up for you. Na play na pala. Bye. Bye. Hashtag wake up with Jim and Sam. Bye. Bye. Bye.